Hey guys, so um, here I am still in Bremerhaven on the uh, second day. Um, it's been quite weird. I feel like I have to be near my laptop the whole time in case anything changes. But um, a really good tip is marinetraffic.com. Uh, I got so I got my email, which I was telling you about yesterday, that told me, oh, you know, your ship's been delayed to a day later. Um, but I just didn't. I just couldn't get rid of the anxiety. So anyway, I found my boat, the MS Leto, on marinetraffic.com and I could see exactly where it was. So I know that it's not supposed to come into Bremerhaven Harbour till about nine tomorrow morning, which made me feel a lot better because it's not like it's there and it could take off at any point. Uh, it's still on its way to the port, which is your, it kind of helped calm me down a bit, which was nice. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, Grandma Haven's alright, a uh, very sleepy town, not much going on. I think the first night I was here there was some sort of festival going on and I just assumed that would be every night, but um, no, it was like a one-off thing. So just a lot, of, a lot of people sitting around, smoking, drinking beer, walking their dogs. Uh, I mean, which is nice, but it would be fine I think if I was with someone else, but on your own, it's a kind of, I've done a lot of walking around also I have no money because uh, I've got to save my money to get the taxi to the port and I'm pretty broke anyway and especially uh, after the having to stay an extra night I can't really spend any money so I bought myself a couple of mezzo mix and some water and I had two beers yesterday and that's about it I'm filling up on my free breakfast from the hotel and then I've got bread paprika crisps and cheese which is my lunch and dinner every day. So I'm really looking forward to being on the boat and actually having proper food three times a day, which is gonna be fucking amazing. <laughs> All right, cheers guys, I'll talk to you soon.